So now you've got your Citizens Band radio installed and you're ready to make your first broadcast to the thousands of fellow Super users out there just waiting to hear from you. You may find that you suffer from mic fright at first. Or you may get stuck for words, but don't worry. Write down what you wish to say if it'll help. Or even earwig on other breakers' conversations until you gain enough confidence to break a channel yourself. When you're ready, tune your channel selector to the appropriate breaking channel for your area. Now, you, you can find out which channel this is by checking with your CB retailer, but for the purposes of this recording, we will be breaking channel 19. OK, so here we go. Hey, come on down for a copy. This means that you are breaking on channel 19 and you are inviting a reply from any fellow breaker. Yeah, you got your copy, good buddy. Crank your handle, come on. Ah, now, a fellow CBA has received your transmission and is asking for your nickname or handle. OK, good buddy, you've got the clipper from the cul-de-sac. That's the Charlie 20, come on. Hey, that's a big 10-4 clipper. You've got the superstar here from Castletown. That's the Lancaster 20, and I'm travelling southbound on the super slab. Are you mobile? Come on. See how easy it is? And notice even the towns and districts can have their own handles, too. If you intend to have a good old ratchet with your fellow breaker, it is courteous to switch to another channel so that the breaking channel is kept clear for anyone else wanting to use it. Negatory on that uh, superstar. So let's take it up to channel 2-3. Yeah, I'm going up. Superstar on channel. OK, superstar, you've got the clipper again. Are you pushing big wheels, good buddy? Yes, we can do the same trip in this. Incidentally, if you are travelling through a district where you are not familiar with a designated braking channel, just use your selector switch to flick through the channels until you hear other breakers calling for a copy. You can then assume that this will be the designated braking channel for that particular area. Big ten four on that superstar. Say, why don't you give me a shout on channel 23 around 3pm tomorrow on the flip-flop? Maybe we could have an eyeball at the motorway services over a cup of sludge. Yeah, big time farm eyeball clipper. Sounds like a great idea. Anyway, thanks for the motivation, good buddy. I'm going to have to get the pedal to the metal now, so good number two, 10 10, we're down, we're gone. Yeah, 10 10, uh, superstar, I'll catch you again. Bye bye, we're gone. One of the most important things a CB operator is interested in is how well his signal is reaching his fellow CBers. If you listen in on conversations between other CB operators, you will more than likely hear the breakers asking for a radio check. Although most CB radios transmit at a maximum of 4 watts output, there are other factors which affect the distance and quality of transmissions. For example, the antenna, the match between the antenna and the receiver, the microphone, and even the location of the rig all have a bearing on how your voice will reach its destination. The most effective way of testing your rig, both in the transmit and receiving modes, is to conduct an on-air radio check. If your CB radio has a meter, this will help to determine the strength of the incoming signal. Now, when the needle on the meter is reading full scale, then the signal is reaching you with maximum output. However, if the meter is only reading half scale, and you are relatively near to the transmitting CB, then the chances are that your fellow CBer has a fault on his rig. Break a one now for a radio check. Go ahead, one man, you got your radio check. What's my modulation like, good buddy? Yeah, your modulation's clean and green and you're blowing your windows out. Ten four on that, good buddy. Thanks a lot for the radio check. Ten ten, we're down and gone. Yeah, we're down, we're gone. Ten ten. The modulation is clean and green and you're blowing my windows out basically means that the voice is coming through very clear and at maximum output. In situations where the output is shown to be low and the modulation weak, it may be that the SWR needs adjusting. Another useful little exercise is request for a time check. Now, if you look in the list of the most frequently used 10 codes, you will notice that time check is represented by the code 1036. Break on now for 1036. It's eight and a half bells on that 10.36, good buddy. OK, thanks a lot, good buddy. 10.10. Many CBers find that both radio and time checks are a way to meet other fellow CBers and to begin other kinds of conversations and relationships. When a radio time check is conducted, it's like calling into the vast unknown and waiting for a response. If it takes a few minutes for an answer to come back, 
the suspense builds and you wonder who and where you're reaching. This is just one of the exciting aspects of Citizens Band Radio. Although the official 10 code is used in America and several other countries by law enforcement agencies to transmit messages quickly and concisely, the code used by Citizens Band operators is known as the unofficial 10 code. It will help you in your transmissions if you are familiar with the most frequently used 10 codes, and here are some which we suggest you learn. 10 1. Receiving poorly. 10 2. Receiving well. 10 3. Stop transmitting. 10 4. OK, message received. 10 5. Relay message. 10 6. Busy, stand by. 10 7. Out of service, leaving the air. 10 9. Repeat message. 10, 10. Transmission completed, standing by. 10, 11. Speak more slowly. 10, 13. Advise weather and road conditions. 10, 20. My location is... 10, 21. Call by telephone. 10, 23. Stand by. 10, 24. Completed last assignment. 10, 26. Disregard last message. 10, 27. I am moving to channel... 10, 28. Identify your station. 10, 32. Radio check. 10, 33. Emergency or accident. 10.34 Trouble at this station, need help. 10.35 Confidential information. 10.36 The correct time. 10.38 Ambulance needed at... 10.41 Please tune to channel... 10.43 A traffic jam at... 10.44 I have a message for you. 10.46 Assist motorist. 10.70 A fire at... 10.73 A speed trap at... 10.74 Negative. 10.84 My telephone number is... 10.85 My address is... 10.91 Talk closer to the mic. 10.93 Check my frequency. 10.94 Give me a long count. 10.95 Transmit a dead carrier for five seconds. 10.97 Signal. 10 100. Time out for personal reasons. 10 200. Police needed at this location. It would also be advantageous to learn some of the most popular words and phrases, and although these may differ slightly from one area to another, the following are universally accepted. Advertising a marked police car with headlights on. Affirmative or 10 4. Yes, I understand. Back door. The last vehicle in a convoy of two or more. Bears. Policeman. A bear taking pictures. Police using radar. Beaver. A girl or female. Big switch. Turning the CB off. Black water, coffee, brown bottle, alcoholic beverage, buffalo, a male, clean and green, 
All clear, no police or obstructions in sight. Come on or come back. Repeat the message. Convoy. A group of vehicles travelling in the same direction, keeping in CB contact. Coffee break. A meeting of CB users. Copy. To hear and understand the message. Ears on. CB radio turned on. Down and on the side. Finished talking but still listening. 88. Love and kisses. Eyeball. To have something in sight. Flip flop. A return trip or U turn. Four wheeler. Any motor car. Good buddy. A friendly term used for fellow sea beers. Good numbers. Best wishes. Granny. A slow driver. Hammer. Accelerator. Handle. A nickname used by a particular sea beer for identification purposes. Home 20. A place where you live. Let the channel roll. Invite others to join in the conversation. Modulate. Talk. Mayday. An international distress call. Mercy sakes. In place of a four letter word. Negatory. No. Over your shoulder. The road behind you. Pick it up. Your turn to talk. Ratchet joying. Talking excessively on a channel. A rig. A transceiver. A slab. A main road or motorway. Smoky. A police officer. Stepped on. Transmissions are being interrupted by other signals. 20. A location. Wall to wall bears. Police everywhere. We gone. Stopping transmissions and standing by. Willy Weaver. A drunken driver. Rapper. The colour of a vehicle. X-ray machine. A police radar trap. We're down, we're gone, bye bye. Closing. There's nothing to stop you making up your own CB phrases and who knows, they may even catch on in your own home 20. Although you are almost totally anonymous on the air, you are expected by other citizens band operators to respect the courtesies of the airwaves. Helping in an emergency, relaying information and courtesy on the air is what CB is all about. We don't particularly need regulations because, well, most of it's common sense. But if you observe these courtesies, you will not only get far more enjoyment out of CB radio, but you will be respected by the others using it. If you want to join in a conversation or use a channel, always wait until the talking has finished and never transmit a dead carrier as it will interfere with other radio sets in the area. Always follow the rules for breaking into a channel or joining in a conversation and never hog a channel. Try to keep prolonged conversations to a maximum of five minutes, thereby giving others a chance to use it. Remember, if you are giving out information to a fellow CB, whether it be about road conditions or maybe just telling the time, try and keep your information as accurate as possible. You never know. Your transmissions may be being heard by thousands of people. So, it is important that the information is valid. If you are not sure about the answers to any request for information, say so. Oh, and never use Channel 9 for anything but emergency services only. If you do, 
You could be preventing important information from being relayed, which could cause someone great inconvenience. It could even be a matter of life or death. As CB radio can be used at any time by an unknown number of people, both young and old, it is important to keep conversations in good taste and to avoid the use of bad language. So don't forget, CB is available to everybody and courtesy costs nothing. Channel 9 has been allocated by the Federal Communications Commission, FCC, for emergency uses only. And many CBers have equipment that automatically monitors Channel 9 full time. However, what do you do if you receive an emergency call on Channel 9? Well, it is important that you make full note of all the details, including exact location, nature of emergency, etc. And depending on the gravity of the situation, you can either deal with it yourself or relay the information to one of the emergency services via the telephone. But you have a responsibility to treat all messages received on Channel 9 as an emergency, which means that they must get immediate attention. Never use 10 codes or CB slang during emergency transmissions or when relaying information regarding an accident. Break a Channel 9 for a copy. Bring it on, Breaker. What's your problem? Uh, I want to report an accident. There's been a collision between two cars at the bottom of Brant's Hill. Police and ambulance are needed urgently, come back. Yes, he's understood, Breaker. I have access to a telephone. So I will inform emergency services immediately. Stand by. Yes, yeah, standing by. Always speak clearly, distinctly, and at a rate that can be easily understood. Remember, citizens band radio can be a lot of fun, but there are times when it can be used to play a more serious role in our society. Let's pick out a few do's and don'ts which we've already discussed, but which you should familiarise yourself with. One, always check that you have a matched antenna connected to your transceiver before keying the mic. Two, don't key the mic if you do not wish to talk. 3. Always switch to a channel other than the breaking channel after making initial contact if you wish to have a prolonged conversation. 4. Don't interrupt a conversation until one or the other breaker has finished speaking. 5. Always speak clearly and distinctly during transmissions. 6. Never use channel 9 for purposes other than during an emergency. 7. Always keep your transmissions limited to talking only. No music, please, and no electronic sounds. 8. Never broadcast your name and address on the airwaves, not even telephone numbers. You never know just who is listening. 9. Always lock your car if you're leaving it unattended, even for a short time. Keep your rig safe. And finally, the cardinal rule. Never use profanities or vulgarities on the air. Now that you know more about the lingo and the tin codes, you're all set to roll with the channels, have a good old ratchet with your good buddies out there on the airwaves. Welcome to a whole new world of CB radio and all its friends. This is Mr. Voiceman signing off now. Have a good day today, a better day tomorrow. We're down, we're gone. Bye-bye. Talking on the CB radio, I Talking on the CB to save a life today. What are you doing now? How about a westbound? Go ahead, you got a westbounder. How's it looking over your shoulder, guy? You have a picture tanker of mile marker 4-2 and a smoky in the grass at mile marker 3-9.